Hello, my friends. It is me, the Black Rush. It's been a while. I'm sure you can't tell it's been a while. But it has been a while, believe me. So, it is getting to be um, Halloween time here in America. And uh, in Russia, we don't play this Halloween shit. They've been trying to actually kill Halloween since 2003. So, we don't do this. We don't, you know. We did it fine when I was growing up, but this new generation, the parents, they think it is danger to children, and they don't do it. They've been trying to shut Halloween down. No can you, the kids are apocalyptic because no candy. So, ah, but, um, so everyone's putting up their, you know, Everyone's putting up their, um, not costumes, that's what they wear. Everyone's putting up, uh, decorations. They're trying to beat each other and win big prize, which is, I don't know, big, really big pumpkin full of candy. I don't know, but, you know, I, when the kids come around, I'm gonna have light off. I don't give out the candy, you know, I am Russian. I have to go by what my people do, my people don't do Halloween, we, you know, we don't want spirits taking our kids' souls, I don't know, but there's a lot of moving parts going on right now, there is like, um, a mosquito I can't see, don't bite me, my Russian blood ice cold, I will freeze you, but um, what was I going to say, I lost all the train. I forgot what it oh so a lot of things going on and one of them is even downstairs we had a um, kind of weird neighbor and all of a sudden she's being nice and so I am weary I don't know I don't know if it's because I was black because I was the Russian because I was Russian and black I don't know she thinks I'm Obama's cousin black Russian socialist trying to take over, I don't know, but she is having, they call it a pampered chef or something, and so, I don't know if I'm going to go, they've got knives and, you know, me, I'm not really allowed to carry on any weapons that I could carry around for free in, in, in Russia, so, I'm not defenseless, I mean, I can fight a bear like the best of them, but you know, if they outnumber me, American women, doing their whole selling, you know, goods or whatever, they may get drop on me, so I don't know, but, what is it going to say, I forgot what I was going to say, I really did, it escapes me, oh, but bouncer a job, so I came into another thing with, a uh, customer got mad at me, because they were dancing with no shoes on the floor, and you know, I've seen it, people drop a uh, glass on the floor and someone who has no shoes, glass drops on it, cuts their foot wide open, blood goes spewing across the floor, like something out of the first Saw movie. So I kept trying to tell her, you got to put shoes on, and she got mad, and she tried to hide behind, I don't know, a boom box, and I could see her, and then she had like three or four friends, and they came up to me, and they were like, what are you trying to tell my friend to put her shoes on? He's is the boss man told me enforce rules, you know, like, well, I know the boss man, and, you know, like, I don't care, the boss man kind of put me in charge, I have kind of carte blanche to kick you out or let you stay, so just put your doggone shoes on, you know, but she, you know, and they get all up in my space, in my personal bubble, you know, I don't like that, I, I drop kick you, you know, but that's either, neither near nor there, I, I mix that one up all the time, but that's about this one. That's, this one's gonna be pretty short because it's so dark and the light is fading. Just wanted to get a quick one in. <laughs> you nasty. That's not what I meant. But yeah, so um, I think that's about it this time. I'm looking blacker than usual. Yeah, I'm looking pretty bad here. So, oh, last thing though. So this is a uh, Kelo one. So mm. 
that was disgusting. That one tried to stay in my mouth even after I tried to spit it out, so... Well, don't strike at the one. That's about it. I'll see you later. That's Vidania. Boop.